Wearing glasses on the golf course really was uncomfortable for me because it was, to me, it was adding another variable to, to my game. And the game of golf, I can promise you, is, is uh, a challenge in itself. And as a, especially as you get older and you become less supple, you don't want to be adding to your troubles. Well, I, I first went into Centre for Sight. I, I called my uh, good friend David Ledbetter and I knew uh, I'd heard of Dr. Shoemaker and I, I knew Centre for Sight was a place where people come from all over the world to get treated. And then during my initial visit with Dr. Shoemaker, he told me he'd done over 100,000 of these operations, which uh, told me everything I needed to know. I had the symphony lenses put in both eyes and um, I've been able to see ever since. The, the experience, the, the, there was no pain and David assured me of that. The whole procedure was uh, amazingly quick. So not having to wear glasses on the golf course and being able to see where my ball lands on the green ultimately it was uh, a wonderful experience. I've been a professional golfer since 1962 winning tournaments in America. I won two major championships, the British Open and the US Open. I played in the Ryder Cup seven times personally. And in 1969, my good friend Jack Nicklaus, who's behind me here, conceded a, a putt on the final green at Royal Birkdale to, for the first tie in uh, Ryder Cup history. Well, these days I, I still travel uh, quite a bit, but my main passion is uh, is marquetry, which is working with veneers and making pictures out of veneers. A lot of eye work, I can tell you, and it's important for me to be able to, to see all this detail, uh, which I can now do without wearing spectacles. We're not here for very long at best, and uh, while we are here, I, I, I like to enjoy the, the best quality of life I can, and uh, having clear vision is very much a part of that.